like the eagle watching the direction of the wind and then it picks, spreads its wings that's what we call soaring it does not fly the eagle soars god keeps saying for one month wake up by two o'clock there's something i'm doing in your life after two weeks you don't wake up again you see how we cheat ourselves and you don't know that you are on the path of deliverance You reign, you reign, hello him, you reign, you reign, you reign, hello him, you reign, you reign, you reign, hello him. I promise you if you listen to what I'm teaching you tonight many of you as soon as you go back you will see the dream you will have this night the devil hates what you are hearing because this is the age-long mystery that has kept people in your family educated bodies like they are not educated a pastor you are blessing people but you never rise yourself do you know why because your victory is tied to your altar not just your service your altar I created an altar that is independent of koinonia and I said no devil will come and destroy me no no watch this please come again the two weeks we are praying Shabra Kato Sotobash Lebre Koto Shabaya we are praying we are praying we are fasting something starts happening one day there will be a breaking point in the realm of the spirit if that prayer were two hours a day will come in to become a vigil not by not because you like it there will be you will break open a portal in the realm of the spirit and two hours prayer will become prayer till morning and your child will come and meet you and say daddy i saw a man in white and i saw the man doing something on your head spiritual activities are happening in the family all of a sudden you start seeing doors opening you love your wife like never before the devil told you the secret is to marry another one no sir you marry another one the altar is still the same there are pastors the altars that fight them anniversaries of their ministry something happens people start leaving they have raised so many people but have not been raised by themselves there are altars i've seen it fight people I've seen it fight people I know. These altars fought me for years. You go to sleep. A strange woman appears to you and sleeps with you in the dream. You get up and say, sorry, I don't know what is happening. Someone is about to marry you. Here comes the stranger again. What is bringing the stranger? Have you ever asked? You relocate to another house. He still looks for you and comes. Kabarota Sigata. They are about to promote you in the office. All of a sudden, your physical document disappears. Physical document. How many students seated here? That's the mystery behind the results you are seeing. The ugly results that you are seeing. You love God and you are sincere. But that's the mystery behind the demonic things you see on that board. You are not that dull. You write your exams and go back. The altars continue writing things. Continue writing things. I know what I'm saying listen to me you hear people coming here with four points they were not born that way they have tapped into a higher covenant you see them surprised by their own results they know it's not their efforts that's why people join certain ministries join certain men of God see people partner with certain anointings this is the mystery of partnership when you partner with an anointing you access the covenant the covenant not the promise the covenant there are parents today the moment you are 50 years arthritis you get up one morning father cannot walk mother cannot walk 
their entire pension is spent on it it's not sickness it's a programming an altar is accurate with digital precision regardless of your foreknowledge it will work it will work i have seen it destroy families i have seen it destroy ministries that's why certain ministries remain small no matter how anointed they are an anointed man with fire on his head but he will not cross certain boundaries once they reach 200 something must happen a wrong news will spread around a scandal must come whether it's true or not have you not seen students their last and final exams they will go and the spirit will start moving them carry something to the exam hall they don't want to but it's an altar you are too weak to fight it you will promise that you will not take it and you take it as soon as you are sitting they just catch you and they said your entire six seven years cancelled brothers and sisters it's an altar there are families that as a family they are victims of abuse everybody mother father brothers all the daughters will eventually meet a man of god somewhere and all the man of god will do is to destroy them it will happen they are scattered in every place but their experiences are the same you will see them and like them but at the end of it you must leave them with pain they think is that the ministry is bad but the issue is the altar there are altars you give birth to men they must die they must die something must kill them no matter how healthy they are they must die brothers and sisters i have seen this evil it exists tonight we are going to pray are we together when it's time i'm not going to give you a prayer point when it's time to pray we are going to pray tonight you are going to erect many of you as you pray tonight you will see what will begin to happen to you i want us to lift up a fire in this place tonight and say lord this demon that molests me in my sleep i can't be pretending that it's not there again these animals that come to me in my sleep no i started a business well why is it that i start good things something evil must come lift your voice and pray
Take it, take it, take it, take it. Come on, pray, pray, pray. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Say after me in the name of Jesus. Shout it. Say in the name of Jesus. Tonight, I stand on behalf of myself and my family. And I declare that every altar that is speaking against my destiny I tear it down tonight lift your voice and pray I tear it down altars of delay altars of barrenness altars of failure Hallelujah. Please pair yourselves to two. Find, find a partner and hold a hand. Be serious, please. If the person by your side is not serious, leave him alone. We are doing serious business tonight. Find a partner and hold a hand. Shabakato labakaria. Embretekas katafraska labakuria dabashi. Say after me in the name of Jesus. Say it again in the name of Jesus. Every legal access I have given for these altars to speak against me knowingly and unknowingly. Tonight, I invoke the blood. Let the blood speak. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Every legal access. Every legal access. Every legal access. I have given any altar of darkness. Even the lawful captives shall be delivered. Even the lawful captives shall be delivered. Even the lawful captives shall be delivered. Hallelujah. Hold the hands of someone else. Look for another partner. Hold the hands of someone else. Say after me in the name of Jesus. Say it again in the name of Jesus. Altars of poverty. Altars of delay. Altars of failure. I speak to you. In the name of Jesus, I tear you down. Release my destiny. Release my destiny. Altars of poverty. Altars.
altars of delay, altars of stagnation. I speak against you. I speak against you. I curse you by the God of heaven. By the God of heaven. Hallelujah. We're really praying tonight. I'm seeing blood dripping on people. God is bringing so many miracles in people. We're still praying, please. We're still praying. Shalapakaya. We're still praying. Skatabariasa. I see altars on fire. We're still praying. We are making real contact with the realm of the spirit. Hallelujah. 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 Say in the name of Jesus. Altars that are territorial in nature. Fighting my destiny. Because of where I'm coming from, I prophesy tonight. Your hold is broken over my life. Lift your voice and pray. Altars associated with territories, associated with territories. I come against you by the God of heaven. I come against you. Pray, pray. I come against you. Hallelujah. 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 Please help those under the anointing. Hallelujah. Listen, there are some of you, your prayers were answered since many years, but it looked like it has not manifested because every time it's reaching you, an altar lifts up. We are going to call it back. Are you ready to pray? Self time in the name of Jesus every delayed blessing that should have happened in my life and was delayed because of these altars tonight by prophecy i call you back to my life lift your voice and pray lift your voice and pray and watch the god of wonders authorize the god of heaven and watch restoration happen in your destiny restore relationships restore finances restore mantles restore ministries Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are going to call the name of your family members. Listen, I don't care how many, call it. Listen, you are going to call them one by one. 
and say i stand as an altar and i bring you out of this dungeon lift your voice and pray call them call them call them mention them by name call them i bring you out of this wasteful living call them Hallelujah. 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 Say in the name of Jesus. Be serious. Say it again in the name of Jesus. I speak to the east. I speak to the west. I speak to the north. I speak to the south. Everywhere my favor is, in the name of Jesus, I command it to my life now. Lift your voice and pray. You don't have to travel, call it everywhere it is. hallelujah I want you to pray listen I want you to pray and talk to God tell him Lord I'm part of this apostolic family the altar you have erected here must speak for me I want my life to show it from today lift your voice and pray pray with understanding and watch what happens to you pray with understanding pray with understanding with understanding Lord I inform the altar that you have with your servant pray with understanding pray with understanding hallelujah many of you may not realize what is happening to you please I don't want you to idolize this teaching no it's not about religiosity it's about proper understanding and application so it's not just coming to lie down here no 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 the altar is a revelation we are going to pray right now and activate back our prayer lives listen because many of us here the only time you pray is when you are together with people 
satan started attacking you he gave himself a five-year plan to attack your prayer life he will never attack it at once he can give himself a five-year plan and be destroying you say in the name of jesus i decree and declare that the spirit of prayer and supplication the grace to pray i receive it right now lift your voice and begin to pray fire fresh fire on my altar fresh grace to pray fresh grace to fast fresh grace to intercede fresh grace for warfare i command every dead prayer life around my life come back to life come back to life hallelujah hallelujah one last prayer point and i'll pray for you there are many of us the spirit of god started revealing things to you because you were meeting with him every day but something happened no more visitation of the secret place and that portal closed over your life no access to illumination you used to be you used to have projects that you and god are on you can literally say we are on a faith project but now there's nothing like that your life has become stale and barren some of you is when you started ministry this this so-called thing called ministry that's what destroyed you we're going to pray a prayer of restoration and the fire will fall upon you i'd like you to pray say in the name of jesus say it again in the name of jesus say holy spirit i ask that you manifest yourself once again in my life holy spirit i cry for intimacy afresh with you lift your voice and begin to pray intimacy spirit of the living god do not be far from me again pray pray let it not be that you are just a stranger we were closer than this and something happened pray restore that intimacy restore that sweet fellowship that i once had with you fellowship that nothing in this world could be compared hallelujah please lift your hands I tell you there will be there will be testimonies upon testimonies I pray for you now I'm praying for you in the name that is above all names everyone hearing me and standing here whether inside or outside you have prayed if there is any altar as i speak now that is speaking against your life at the count of three i command those altars to catch fire right now please get ready the power of god will come on people one two three I command those altars now. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. I command those altars be broken. Be broken. Listen. Lift your hands. 
I'm challenging altars of failure. Listen, just I'm praying for you. Don't pray, just listen to me. Because I'm seeing people here. Failure, it has nothing to do with academics, it makes you fail in everything. I stretch my hands. May that fire anyone here who is a victim, that altar is speaking. I stand by the rod of a higher priesthood and I judge those altars now. I judge those altars now. I judge those altars now. I judge those altars now by fire. I judge those altars now. There are altars that cause men to see things and never handle it. You see a job, they tell you it's yours. Quarter to reception, everything changes. I don't know who belongs to that category, but in the name of Jesus, inside and outside, following online, anyone who has been a victim, of total failure and disappointment right now in the name of Jesus that fire comes upon you in the name of Jesus that fire comes upon you in the name of Jesus I command total deliverance help them help them please total deliverance in the name of Jesus Christ put down your hands ladies keep your hands lifted I will tell you why I'm praying There are many ladies let me tell you many people don't know why things don't work especially for ladies it's not because you are ladies and it's not because you are bad it's because many ladies are spiritually ignorant of what they represent in the realm of the spirit a lady is not just another human being who is not a man no it's more than that a lady is the chiefest point of entrance even among men that's why she has a womb the only lady a lady is a gate in the realm of the spirit it's not just a human being keep your hands lifted that's why demons look for them that's why spirits look for them that's why altars speak against them it may not be caused by you but i'm praying for you keep your hands lifted you may not understand what is happening lord jesus i'm praying now that any one of our sisters here whose family and destiny is under siege I'm declaring anyone who made a covenant with the earth for your destiny anyone who passed through fire to make a covenant with your destiny in the name that is above all names I decree and declare upon every lady now be free in the name of Jesus be free in the name of Jesus from those yokes, those yokes that cause fibroid, those yokes that cause fibroid, those yokes that cause lumps around your body, those lumps, those barrenness, I cause it by the God of heaven. I cause it by the God of heaven. hallelujah I'm seeing 11 ladies the Lord is opening my eyes listen now I'm seeing rings on all their ten fingers and this is a very serious demonic case and the Lord wants to set them free now you will not know it is not something you know one of you used to see it physically you see rings on your hands in the name of Jesus 11 people ladies especially I'm praying now some are inside some are outside doesn't matter where you are the Lord is asking me to stretch my hands Lord I pray whoever came into this meeting whether online offline and belongs to that category in the name of Jesus as I'm praying now I command I'm praying now the fire will fall on certain people 11 in all I see Lord let it be right now I, I break that marriage I break that spiritual marriage 
I break that spiritual marriage, my God, my God, my God, my God. I break that spiritual marriage. Satos Bratos Susi Pariatash. There's one of them you should have married. But this is what stops everybody that comes around you. I command it broken right now. 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 Hallelujah. Our time is gone. The Lord is asking me to minister to someone here. Somebody comes to you in the night physically. I'm not talking of vision. Physically. You feel somebody lying down around your bed. Sometimes sleeping with you. You are feeling it. This is not guesswork. This is something you know is happening. Wherever that person is. Right now in Jesus name. I stretch my hands. There is no escape. In the name of Jesus. Whether inside or outside. You are in this category now. I command judgment. Judgment on any strange spirit. Judgment on any stranger. Judgment on any stranger. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I don't know, but we're rounding up. Please just, just be patient with me. I'm hearing in my spirit, Yoruba people. Yoruba people, there is there is something, a deliverance that God is bringing now to Yoruba people. You know how God acts as I'm speaking now. Everyone associated with that territory, I place the word of God now. In the name of Jesus, let that sword of deliverance, I command that double-edged sword to locate everyone from the southwestern part now who is in need of territorial deliverance. I command it now, inside and outside. In the name of Jesus, no escape. No escape for any power of darkness. Yeah, na 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 na. Yeah, na 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 na. Yeah, na 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 Every mark of disfavor that is on anyone's life here. You watch what happens to your life from this meeting. Anyone carrying any mark of disfavor where men should bless you something about you becomes an irritation i command that mark to be erased from your life now ah, i command that mark to be erased from your life now i command that mark to be erased from your life now I command that mark to be raised from your life now. I command that mark to be raised from your life now. I'm watching what is happening from the spirit realm, not the physical realm. When you see me keep praying, it's because God is doing something. I command that mark to be raised from your life now. I say it again. I command that mysterious mark to be erased from your life right now. anyone here who has any member of your family that has refused to give birth they have tried and tried and the devil would just not let them have a child either she will not take in completely or she would take in and then mysteriously lose the child or the man will not be able to get her pregnant i don't care what situation but please, even if you are not the one standing for them, I'm praying. Distance is no barrier. I stretch my hands now and I decree by the altar of prayer, 
we authorize angelic assistance to those people right now we authorize angelic assistance right now hear me it was an angel that came to assist mary to get pregnant he showed up and said i was sent your own is to just agree and she said be it unto me and she got pregnant i declare and declare that any manifestation and encounter that they need to go through to have their child i command it to happen now in the name of jesus let me pray finally for your finances i believe in god's people empowered there is no triumph when everything around your life is not working i want to speak because some of you are titers some of you are sowers some of you bless honor god's house but simply because of certain systems that manifestation can happen as laziness that manifestation can happen as disfavor everywhere in the name of jesus i decree and declare nobody here is too young to prosper don't listen to that nonsense nobody here i'm not talking of business i'm not talking of a job i'm talking of a system in the spirit where god will lift you in a way that will make you afraid i decree and declare now as i'm praying for you i'm also praying for families because there are families that need help as a matter of emergency i pray that the demon sitting on the financial destiny of anyone here sitting on the financial destiny of any family i clear it out of the way right now i clear it out of the way right now i clear it out of the way right now i clear it out of the way right now in the name of jesus christ listen listen i've shared with you my encounter i've seen that spirit that they call mammon i've seen it i've shared it here some years ago when i was praying and all of a sudden my ceiling disappeared and all of a sudden i saw a giant creature like him as tall as a mango tree standing looking like um like 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 a dinosaur a sea creature with a tail and the tail was another living thing on its own it could detach from that creature and move and the eyes were as big as a human head two red fierce eyes and he was looking at me and he said so you think you can bring god's people into blessings and that was the end of the encounter that was it was that day i knew that wealth is spiritual it's not about what you do it's about what is backing you you can do everything to a poor there must be a spirit assisting you i call for the ministry of the holy spirit over your finances and i command extraordinary results from today i command strange results from today i command strange favors from today i command strange results from today strange encounters with destiny help us in the name of jesus christ i want you to wave your hands to jesus the bible says to pray with thanksgiving tell him thank you thank you this is part of a fruitful prayer you don't round up a prayer with amen you round up with prayer with genuine thanksgiving lord i in the name of jesus christ the one whom i serve and whose i am in the name of jesus i declare over every force in the spirit the covenants and the ordinances of darkness that have held the lives of god's people as they shout this shout wherever they are i command those spirits he said when they hear my voice they will run out of their hiding I command not only an exposition but a total separation are you ready to shout Jesus at the count of three one two three in the name of Jesus I command that fire to fall every power every enchantment every enchantment every enchantment every enchantment every enchantment every enchantment go now go now go now every enchantment 
every enchantment every enchantment be free now hold on hallelujah i usually don't do this until i'm directed hallelujah i usually see pillars of fire standing by my left and right i just want to pass through you don't have to touch me except it is not god that has called this meeting if there is a force and a spirit it must be exposed as i pass you in the name of jesus thank you father i decree and declare right now by the anointing of the holy ghost every power every force every power every force every power every force you must go now now by the anointing of the holy ghost in the name of jesus as i pass you that anointing like fire is coming upon you to set you free be free now free now free now free now in the name of jesus be free now in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ those of you outside lift your hands lift your hands i'm going to pass here right now the anointing of the spirit is going to begin to come upon you are you ready now thank you jesus you don't have to touch me just just allow me pass be careful be careful father in jesus name let it be over now there is fire now that fire is moving all across now in the name of jesus ordinances be broken now i'm seeing fire just around here where my hands are in the name of jesus let there be freedom now let there be freedom now let there be freedom now be free now let it be over now 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 in the name of jesus christ be free now in the name of jesus as i'm passing close to you an anointing is causing every power let them go the spirit of the lord is telling me to stand here right now in jesus name let there be deliverance now let there be deliverance now from every force of darkness every force of every force of darkness be free now i came here because i know that there are so many of you look the crowd in this place i want to pray for you i'm standing here my god look at the oppression that i see just standing here i'm about to pray right now and from the front to the back from the left to the right i want all of you to shout jesus something is leaving people already are you ready now your destiny must be open please don't take it for granted bring them out now at the count of three overflow three one two three be free now be free now in the name of jesus i command my god please help them jesus christ look what is happening here from the front to the back right now anyone here under the siege of darkness be free now be free now help them be free now lift your hands overflow three i'm praying for you are you ready to shout jesus again there are many of you you try to move forward but the force keeps holding you as you shout jesus now you're going to see something leave you are you ready father all those who have been held captive, i declare that as they shout jesus let your fire of deliverance come upon them one two three i release you now i release you now i release you now go forward i release you now delay broken i release you now i release you now i release you now i release you now in the name of jesus hallelujah listen i'm going to pray for everybody but the lord is saying there are some of you here the call of god is upon your life but there are altars fighting you i'm about to release you oh god i'm seeing 17 17 where are they oh god 
right now to the back where are they they have the call of god but an altar of darkness tying down their lives be free now hallelujah i'm going to pray for you look up please there are 11 of you the lord is saying it is you that you will use to help your family and the anointing that anointing of that joseph's anointing to distinguish you is coming on 11 people lord where are they to the back right to the back that anointing a destiny is rising no even if you are the last born i decree and declare let that anointing find you now let that anointing find you now the joseph anointing the joseph anointing that will cause you to save your brethren hallelujah please lift your hands overflow three it's not about falling down although there are several things happening here but i want you to just focus the last prayer i want to pray for you many of you will be surprised what happens to you listen i'm seeing keys like a key that was missing some of you were once you were destined for certain things and the devil veered off your life and as it is right now the treasure that god gave you you have lost it as i pray for you that restoration anointing is coming upon you some of you is anointings some of you is business connections lord where are they at the count of three let that fire come shout jesus at the count of three one two three receive that grace now restoration fire 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 shake up butter please open your mouth and begin to pray begin to pray begin to pray great grace great grace great grace great grace new season, new season. mama look at me it's over over forever over 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 it's going to use you in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ please everyone pray in the spirit. everyone pray in the spirit everyone pray in the spirit Everyone pray in the spirit. Please pray in the spirit. Please pray in the spirit. Pray in the spirit. Pray in the spirit. Overflow one, pray in the spirit. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Overflow one, I want to minister to you now. Listen, please, I want you to believe everything. I want to pray for you. Lift your hands, all of you. There are some of you here, as I'm looking, I'm just seeing chains. I want to pray at the count of three. I didn't come to waste your time. Right now, that chain is going to leave people now. Anyone here under the sound of my voice, and there is a chain of darkness, overflow one. I declare at the count of three right now, let that chain be broken. One, two three i command that chain be broken now help them please be broken now to the back shakasko pariata zato secretary akata be broken broken fire is coming i'm seeing fire moving across the crowd in the name of jesus christ i break every force every yoke of darkness hallelujah Are you pregnant come 
I'm seeing an evil spirit. Let her go now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Let her go. By the anointing of the spirit. I release the destiny of this baby. You will not lose this baby. In the name of Jesus Christ. Help her. This lady praying in tongues. In the name of Jesus Christ. The grace. For dreams and visions. The Lord is releasing it upon you. Great for dreams and visions. Hallelujah. Now I'm going to walk across this crowd. Please. I just want you to release your faith. Release your faith and receive something now. As I walk through. I'm seeing altars. And they are living right now. Thank you Jesus. Father. Let there be deliverance right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Let that fire. As I move. Oh God. Let the angel of your presence move. Let there be deliverance. It is over. That's what the Lord says to you. Over now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Over. 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 Shabbos Katai. Sheketis Kalabra Katoziata Katai. Over now. In the name of Jesus. Over. By the anointing of the Holy Ghost. It is over. Please believe. As I'm passing you, don't, don't worry. The anointing of God will locate you. Over now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Let it be over now. Now. Over your life. Let it be over. I'm seeing fire moving here like this. Who is that fire for? In Jesus' name, I stretch my hands. Let there be deliverance right now. Supernatural deliverance right now. Supernatural deliverance right now. Mama, be free. Now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Supernatural deliverance. Um, I'm seeing a circle here. And the Lord is saying, restoration of ministerial anointing. A circle. Lord, where are they? There are people here, at least four of you. I stretch my hands. Let the anointing locate you. The call for ministry. The call for ministry. The call. Parakato sedekatoshia. Enter. Enter that level. That's what I hear in the spirit. Enter. Enter that dimension. Enter that dimension. Enter that dimension. Enter that dimension in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Who is is it victory or Victoria? I'm hearing a name like a victory or Victoria. Who is that? Please, very quickly, want to pray for the sick now. It's like you are wearing something like blue. Blue. Who is that person? What's your name, madam? Yes, sir. This is your first time here? No, sir. You've been coming. Madam, look at me. God is going to change your story. Completely. Amen. I don't know you, but yes. the Lord is saying he's bringing breakthrough. Amen. Amen. Hold my hands. Look at me. There is bad luck on your life, my dear. Good things come, but they never stay. And the Lord is saying to take it away right now. Be free. In the name of Jesus, I take away that spirit from your life. I set you free to move forward in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. And we go in who is Victoria again? All the victories of Victoria be made free right now in Jesus' name. Can we go in from here? Everyone open your mouth and begin to pray. Prophesy. Say in the name of Jesus, I'm breaking forth spiritually. In the name of Jesus Christ. It's a new level for me. It's a new level for me. Enter a new dimension enter a new dimension now in the name of jesus lift your hands i'm passing here now there is an anointing move move to the next level i'm prophesying to everybody standing here within the vicinity of this anointing step into a new dimension i release that grace now i release that grace now i stretch my hands everything that has held you down let it leave you now in the name of jesus my god look at this are you seeing the legs are rotting completely in the name of Jesus be free now I command be free now in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ look at me my dear go home and write it good news comes for me in 12 days Lord lose their destinies I'm standing here and I'm, there is an anointing. Let the destiny be open now. Open now. Shabbat Sokos Kaliata. 
embreketo sasikete likata jekros kadabalako tesiyanamahasiya in the name of jesus christ i'm standing here and i'm hearing i have called you accept my call accept my call accept my call accept my call my call is upon your life my call is upon your life stop fighting my call is upon your life that's what the spirit of god is saying my call is upon your life accept my call my call is upon your life my mandate is upon your life my mandate is upon your life that's what god is speaking my mandate is upon your life you cannot fight it it's an ordinance decided from heaven my mandate is upon your life light me lord light me lord light me lord like a candle light me lord light me lord light me lord like a candle light me lord light me lord light me lord like a candle pastor lawrence speed come where is where is your wife to be? come come two of you i see a grace for speed lift your hands enter that dimension now i release that grace speed to your life the lord is taking away delay go and mark it you are entering a strange level i see you climbing a ladder and the lord is saying it's time for your glory it's time for your glory light me lord light me lord light me lord collect that child quickly from kenny collect that child speed that grace collect that child in the name of jesus i'm seeing that grace a new dimension of speed coming upon your life a new level of speed coming upon your life a new level of speed hallelujah Ejimi, i'm seeing something for you i'm seeing please stand up i'm seeing a bottle of oil and i'm seeing dollars a bottle of oil and dollars these two dimensions the spirit and supernatural resources that grace the lord is multiplying it i'm seeing a bottle a bottle of oil a bottle of oil the lord is giving you a voice not only in the area of finances but a strange demonstration of the spirit please be patient we are going to pray for the sick but tonight i i perceive god is doing something strange young man come come you and this guy two of you come stand step into a new dimension new dimension in the name of jesus you will never be the same this guy just lift your hands where you are come enter a new level in the spirit i release that grace now upon you in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ i'm looking at people and i'm seeing something rising from your stomach to your throat and the lord is saying is the spirit of prophecy lord i'm declaring right now it's happening to people right now it will come upon you like a mantle prophecy 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 from your belly from your belly prophecy i command those rivers makato sakata rivers of living water rivers 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 in the name of jesus christ this lady come you come quickly there is a grace the call of god is upon your life enter that dimension of his grace may the lord give you visitations 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 I bring you out of the cage that I see you in. I bring you out of the cage. I bring you out of the cage. I see you inside the cage. I bring you out of the cage. In the name of Jesus, by fire, I bring you out. I bring you out. Ancestry will not fight you. I bring you out of the cage. In the name of Jesus Christ. We are soon going to pray for the sick.
Where's where's your wife? Where is she? The Lord is saying the powers will fight no more. Come. The powers will fight no more. 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 There are ordinances fighting this family. I see it in the spirit. The powers will fight no more. In the name of Jesus, victory is established. The powers will fight no more. The powers will fight no more. The powers will fight no more. In the name of Jesus, and he's stepping to a new level of the prophetic that has always been there. In the name of Jesus Christ. Shalabarakatos. This usher lady, come. In the name of Jesus Christ, you will begin to see things before they happen. That's what the Lord is saying, I should tell you. God is putting something in your eyes. You will see things. Shata Sotosha. Mari Katos Kobaria Kata. You will see things before they happen. In the name of Jesus, with precision, with precision, and with accuracy, with precision, with precision, with precision, and with accuracy. Where are these people that just married this lady in welfare? Where is she now? You and your wife, where are they? She's not around. Stand up. Let me pray for you on her behalf. In the name of Jesus Christ, I'm praying for your mother. Let the Lord perfect her. But I'm praying for you. Something wants to take finances off your life. If I don't pray for you, I see great suffering in the days coming. It's like finance just dries up to the point that even your basic needs you cannot meet. But I cancel it right now by the anointing of the Holy Spirit. I cancel it right now in the name of Jesus. This fair lady, an angel is pouring oil on your head. That's what I'm seeing right now. An angel is pouring oil on your head. Breakthrough. Step into a new dimension. Step into a new level. In the name of Jesus Christ. A new level. A new level. In the name of Jesus Christ. Wato. Where is she? Is she here? I'm seeing a flag being raised up. And the Lord is saying it's a new season. I'm seeing a flag being raised up in the spirit. The Lord is announcing you. I'm declaring, let that anointing come upon you. A new season. Let that flag be raised. In the name of Jesus, let that flag be raised. You will never, never be down. Let that flag be raised. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. We're going to pray for the sick. Let's just flow. God... You know sometimes this is this lady you come yes say for my shame say it for my shame I receive double the Lord is taking me to a new level and I receive it I lay my hands upon you in the name of Jesus the grace for a new level is released upon you right now I command it so I declare it so in Jesus' name I pray. This gentleman, you, come. Confusion ends now in your life. I lay my hands upon you. I command confusion to end right now from your life. In the name of Jesus. Confusion ends now over your life forever. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Confusion ends over your life. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I'm seeing, I will, I will prophesy generally, but I'm seeing a family having the breakthrough of a new car and an anointing. I'm, 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 it may not look like it's necessary for you, but I'm seeing an anointing locating that family now. This is, this is a, a blessing of a car. You will stand and testify. I don't care whether the resources are there or not. I stretch my hands. Let that anointing make it happen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Let that anointing by the Spirit make it happen right now. Help that person please. Let that anointing make it happen right now. In the name of Jesus. Make it happen. Cameraman, come. I want to pray for you. Look at me. 
it will surprise you the kind of favor you will start walking in amen you believe what i'm saying lift your hands father let this brother drink of the grace for favor a fresh dimension a fresh dimension a fresh dimension of favor in the name of jesus christ this lady you come the lord is saying i'm rolling away reproach from your life everything that looks like reproach i lay my hands upon you i'm literally feeling like there are holes on your head and the anointing is going through i command reproach go and never return from her life in the name of jesus christ now we're going to pray for the sick please we're going to be very fast we're going to be very fast listen to me if you have any cancer related issue or barrenness whether you are in overflow one two or three i will want to pray for you by myself otherwise overflow one um I'm in the main auditorium i want you to come out over all the overflows just come to the front stand up stand up come to the front of your projector stands quickly please come to the front of your projector stands for god's sake not to embarrass you but look at this woman's leg look at this look at this doctor look at this is this sickness look at how the whole leg is rotting already please quickly you're sick in your body come quickly stand if the people cannot move just keep them where they are or bring them close so that you don't um are we together now we're going to pray it will be very fast because our time is gone we want to finish on time the devil is a wicked person for these kinds of oppression are we together there are so many people in overflow tree and uh, god will grant grace pastor lawrence come you will join them today when our backs were against the wall and it looked as if it was over you made a way hallelujah father in the name of jesus by the corporate anointing we pray these people have come expecting to be healed expecting to be touched i pray that your anointing will visit them right now in the name of jesus overflow one overflow two overflow three let there be a release of the corporate grace right now in the name of jesus christ we're free now in the name of jesus christ what's wrong with you my dear huh fracture where how long where is the leg it can't move and your hand don't worry it's okay and your legs lord jesus please walk help this lady miracle, jesus. in the name of jesus walk my miracle here i release today. that anointing upon you right walk now my miracle, i correct your jesus. body now hallelujah praise the lord hallelujah please stretch your hands here and begin to pray in the spirit if they are still praying for you outside just just continue please if your request is yet to come here you can quickly wave it wave it and let the ushers have it and bring it here quickly stretch your hands stretch your hands by faith believing that god will visit you don't don't stretch your hands out of unbelief if there are requests here to come please let them come here quickly please bring them quickly Shabakato soprakato baladabash unto you that answers prayers oh god shall all flesh come rakato sodo prendege barakato shabradiski labaria enda kato sata prakato jalabaria kato prendege degodos please pray you are praying in the spirit you are connecting lord we are believing that we will not have to write this again be serious about it make sure you are connected by faith shakato kaparakato barikata sipriada balaraba Shakata parakata paroto subriash. Lord, arise in majesty. Arise in your power. Visit the case of people. Change impossible situations. In the name of Jesus Christ. 
Shata prakatu barakatu barigete kete Shelekete pranda kata barakatus Eketo kaparuka tabariyadaba Lord let this be the last time they will write this In the name of Jesus Christ Let this be the last time they will write this In the name of Jesus Let this be the last time Shabakata pakata 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 Endeketo rakato shadabragadabaladaba Lord we believe in you Arise, O God of heaven. Arise, O God of heaven. Arise, O God of heaven. Visit your people. Arise, O God of heaven. Visit your people. Shabakata parada baroto soto predegate. Legata kato prandegate presha de bele de bosh. Hallelujah. 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 Please respond with a resounding amen. In the name of Jesus. Father, this is not a ritual. I stand on behalf of your people. Lord, these requests represent different dimensions of demonic Jerichos standing between them and the place of destiny. Father, as I step upon this, let this be symbolic of the ark going around Jericho. Yeah. Hallelujah. Listen, you're going to shout jesus we're going to shout jesus seven times are we together as a prophetic act over this i'm going to guide you and you will shout it for every one shout let it represent one day going around jericho that at the seventh time we are agreeing together that no matter what the issue is if you don't believe you will never never see the salvation of god but for believers you'll be surprised father that you hearken to this prophetic act and oh god i stand leading your people as we shout that name the name of our high priest who has been exalted above the ironic priesthood above any kind of priesthood are you ready now i'll call the number and you shout jesus are you ready number one Number two. Jesus. Crumbling every mountain. Number three. Jesus. Shabakoto Sopataya. Makrotoba. I tell you, I feel the fire of God as we're shouting this Jesus. Number four. Number five. Jesus. Number six. Jesus. I put an anointing on this seventh shout. Let this be the shout that crumbles every mountain. In the name of Jesus. Number seven. Jesus. I decree and declare unto you prepare for strange testimonies in the name of Jesus Christ some of you even before you get to your homes or where you came from you will meet it waiting for you like a messenger in the name of Jesus Christ hallelujah please lift your hands let's take the prophecy and then we'll Every shame and reproach that has lingered in your life shame and reproach some of you is a pattern across your family members in the name of Jesus Christ I command shame and reproach be rolled over your life forever be rolled over your life forever be rolled over your life forever hallelujah i release over your life supernatural grace for speed in life supernatural grace for speed in life supernatural grace for speed in life hallelujah 
I decree and declare that every garment he saw Joshua the high priest and he said to remove that garment every garment you are wearing that is attracting bad luck attracting all kinds of things the Bible says to give them a garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness I tear off that garment from your life I tear off that garment from your life garment of reproach I tear it off from your life I tear it off from your life in the name of Jesus Christ I decree and declare divine direction Lord what do I do where do I go to tonight by dreams and visions and strange encounters I provoke divine direction to come to your direction in the name of Jesus Christ master we have toiled all night but I prophesy to you go back this time around to the same place you failed I anoint you go and succeed I anoint you go and succeed I anoint you go and surpass the ordinary in the name of Jesus Christ every door that has refused to open your parents tried it refused to open the Bible says lift up your heads O ye gates and be ye lifted O ye not doors ancient doors I come against every ancient door and every gate swing open now in the name of Jesus swing open now in the name of Jesus swing open now in the name of Jesus every helper that must arise tonight not tomorrow tonight every helper ordained by God to rise up and come to your aid I provoke favor towards you from them I provoke favor towards you from them I provoke favor towards you from them listen whoever has what it takes to help you in the name of Jesus I direct their eyes to you I say it again whoever has what it takes to help you I direct their hearts to you the same mystery that bound Jonathan and David I declare wherever your helper is let it be as it were for Jonathan and David in the name of Jesus Christ all those in ministry here I prophesy to you a strange unction upon the work on your hands step into a new direction step into a new dimension in the name of Jesus Christ every family here that has cried that's all you've known to do cry and cry and say when will God deliver us I declare that your weeping has endured enough I prophesy your morning comes and with it joy in the name of Jesus Christ those writing exams let the mercy of God the mercy that helped those who went before you may that same mercy speak for you may that same mercy speak for you may that same mercy speak for you hallelujah there are people here you are sensing that your spiritual life is dry it's not like you don't love God but revelations they don't come as they used to come again sometimes you open your Bible you cannot even read to pray you are sensing something is wrong it's like you know your spiritual life is under attack in the name of Jesus Christ I launch you to the new a new insight a new dimension of encounter a new dimension of encounter a new dimension of encounter the Lord will open your eyes to not only listen to teachings but to get the spirit of the message there are some of us the devil has cheated us by allowing our prayer altar go down in the name of Jesus tonight let fire from heaven fall upon your prayer life let the quickening of the spirit fall upon your prayer life 
every wrong friend in your life whether you want them to go or not in the name of jesus for the sake of god's hand upon your life i separate you with them forever this night i separate you with them forever time wasters destiny wasters i cause a separation between you and them forever we're rounding up some of us here are plagued with the spirit of laziness spiritual laziness mental laziness physical laziness the bible says a lazy hand a slothful hand will that a one that deals with a slothful hand will beg he will become poor i decree and declare the spirit of productive diligence not just diligence the spirit of productive diligence i release it upon you right now are you ready to receive favor i will continue to pray favor upon your life until it works i decree and declare in the name of jesus christ even if you have seen favor in your life by the grace of god i release you to a new order of favor a new order of favor a new order of favor favor is not when you have money favor is when men arise by god to meet your needs if you have money and men don't come to your life you are not favored you are only prosperous you are not favored favor is when men arise that before you call they come they don't come and go they come and stay until the purposes of god have been achieved i call them now from the east the west the north and the south help us of your destiny may they appear before you in the name of jesus christ I don't know what personal request you desire from God but I release my faith with you and I declare that by miracle service may you will only return rejoicing over that issue in the name of Jesus Christ anyone here trusting God for a good job not just a job that you look like a slave a job with honor in the name of Jesus I agree with you between now and next miracle service may god bless you with a job that will launch you to a new dimension everyone in business here the god factor the favor factor the help factor the ebenezer factor i release it upon your business i release it upon your field of endeavor in the name of jesus christ the Bible says, where thou hast been rejected so that no man will pass through you. It says, I will make you an eternal excellency and a joy of many generations. I decree and declare, may your gates be continually open. Now, I want to pray a prayer that may be very strange for some of us. I want to pray that somebody will give you money. Listen. Hold on, listen. We are not money mongers. This is not some carnal thing. There are some of you, this is what you need. You don't need advice. You don't need counseling. You just need help. Straight help. I pray for you. You will be surprised. It will look like a dream. I pray for you. Not a helper, not access. Thank God for it. But a helper that will come with the financial resource. To help you i stretch my hands and i release it upon you in the name of jesus christ the anointing for miracles help that guy the anointing for signs to bring them out 51 people don't shout don't do nothing just keep your hands the lord is asking me to stretch my hands and the power of God, that unction for deliverance will move like wildfire all through the overflows. Right now, I stretch my hands in the name of the Lord God, whose I am and whom I serve. Right now, I release the ministry of angels. Mighty deliverance right now. Bring them out. Shalabrakataya. 
Reketo Soprata Calabrasca Labriana Sapraska Tapracatele Catia Labas Sopre Ketali Prasca Variata Embrecoto Soto Pareketa The fire of God is visiting individuals for their families. I see fire burning, that's what I'm seeing. Bring them out. Just keep your hands lifted. The angel of his presence moving inside and outside. Moving inside and outside. Please quickly, let's have them. Shalapakuratai. Legretos Kopri Shalapariatako. Overflow one. I see a strange activity of angels. Strange deliverance. Shigala Parakoto Soto Balada. You reign. You ancient Zion's king. Kadosh, Kadosh. You are mighty in God. You reign. You ancient Zion's king. Kadosh, Kadosh. You are mighty on your throne. Keep your hands lifted. Malekete pekete la kaya. Ay 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 ay. Mighty on the road. You reign. You ancient Zion's king. Kadosh. Kadosh. Help that lady please. You are mighty on the road. Break for. Down fountains of the deep and weep. Kadosh, mighty on your Aye. Keep your hands lifted. I'm seeing snakes. That's what I'm seeing. Just flying up. Snakes. I'm seeing many ladies being delivered from this influence. Right now, I stretch my hands in the name of Jesus. Mateketa. I put the word of God upon this prophecy in the name of Jesus. I release upon it the power to perform those influences in the name of Jesus. I release judgment, 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 judgment upon every strange influence limiting the life of God's people. Break forth down fountains of the deep and weep and weep and weep at all. You reign, you reign, you reign, you reign. Hallelujah. Now lift your hands. Jesus, I'm seeing gates, gates with chains. One shout is what will bring that gate down. Are you ready? Just a shout of the name of Jesus. One, two, three. I open those gates. Be open by the unction of the Spirit. Gates be open. Ephata be open. The gate must open. Tonight is a miracle service. I prophesied the two lift gate be open. The two lift gate. Many of you don't know what is happening in the realm of the spirit. I tell you, I see gates, gates of destinies, gates of possibilities that are being held by witchcraft, gates over families. No progress, no results. I come tonight with an apostolic and a prophetic anointing. Gates be open. Gates be open. Yeah, 
Gates be open. Gates be open. Listen. Listen to me. A gate is what gives a man access. Access into a place. Access out of a place. The Bible says to open the doors of prison. There are men who are moving. But they are under prison. There's nothing. Hear me. You may be here listening to me. There's nothing you do that works. No matter how you try. Seek advice. It will not work. No matter what you do. You are not bad. You are not lazy. But there is a spirit. But right now lift your hands. In the name of Jesus. One more time. I come against the spirit. That stand as gatekeepers. Over the victory of people. Over the life of people. At the count of three. I want you to shout that name. The name that is a key. That opens the gate. One. Two. Three. I open it. I open it. I open it. Online. Outside. I command it to open. I command it to open. Locked by ancestry. Locked by divination. Locked by necromancy. And projection. Manipulation of the constellations. I command. In the name of he. That holds the key of David. I command. That door be open. That no power can shut. Be sensitive tonight. The spirit of God is moving. One of the ushers. One of the ushers. You are an usher. But the unction of the spirit. Help her. Visiting your family. Visiting your family. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm seeing a lady quickly. There's no time to speak. Our time is gone. We have to pray for the sick. But I'm seeing a lady. You have two sisters. Two of them are barren. They are married. No children. Please, where are you? It's part of your prayer request. You are wearing a black dress. You are the one. Come. Hello, Thy kingdom come. I will be Ah, there's witchcraft in your family. Look at me. Come. You are a great lady, but there is terrible witchcraft in your family. There is a lady. Again, the Lord is opening my eyes. I don't know why this happens. I'm seeing a map. Benway. Benway. Benway people get ready. Benway. 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 I see Benway. And the Lord says, stretch your hands and bring deliverance to men in Benway. I stretch my hands right now. The anointing of the Spirit visiting people. Benway. 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 By the Spirit of God. By the Spirit of God. Hear me. And I'm hearing in my spirit, break the covenant of motherhood. I don't know what this means. But this is something that has to do with a covenant involving women. I arrest it right now. In the name of Jesus. I see fire dropping right now. People from Benway. You are from Benway. You come under this influence. Please help that. Yes. Benway. Benway. The spirit of the living God. The spirit of the living God. Traveling to Benway. Breaking covenant. I speak to the soil of that land. Release the destinies. Tied with you. Listen. What I'm seeing is not good. The Lord is taking me to a vision. And I'm standing. And I'm seeing black ropes. Around trees. This is Otuko. Black ropes. Tied around trees. And the Lord tells me that the destiny of men were tied to those trees. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lift your hands. At the count of three. May the fire 
that the God of Elijah commanded, I command it right now upon every shrine, every activity of darkness. In the name of Jesus, let it come upon you now. Let it come upon you now. Let it come upon you now. Hallelujah. The supernatural, I've taught you, operates only in partnership with five elements. Listen. Without one or more of these elements, the supernatural cannot find expression. Guy, I'm seeing a wild, this is a serpent. I'm looking at this person and I'm not seeing a human being again. I'm seeing a serpent. I stretch my hands. The Bible says, For the light shines in darkness. And the darkness comprehended it not. Now listen carefully. Five elements of the supernatural. Number one is light. The supernatural cannot find expression until it can use the medium of light. Number two, the air, sound. The supernatural cannot find expression until there is a medium of sound. Number three, the earth. The earth is a universal point of contact. Every living thing makes contact with it. Number three. Are we together? Number four, water. The mystery that bears witness. Water is not an entity. Water is history. Water is a memory bank of the realm of the spirit. Contained within it are more mysteries than we understand. Number five, fire. A mystery entity that does not run away from anything and yet consumes everything. Purifies and destroys. Can make and kill. The only personality with the quality of fire is God. Can make a life and destroy. It would destroy another thing and in it lift another thing. Purify gold and destroy the impurities. I want us to use one of the elements of the supernatural. Because everyone is standing on the ground. I want to pray for you. The Lord is asking me to break delay. Please just follow me. We are coming to the sick people. But just follow me tonight. Let's walk circumspectly. I'm seeing people whose feet have been tied down. They cannot move. You are here. No matter what you do, there is no progress. This is the story of your family. Look at me. The Lord wants to visit you first, even before your family. Your two sisters, they are married, no child. Are you married? You are not married. We have to pray. I don't know if you believe what I'm telling you, but God is raising you to be a savior in your family. Believe this thing, no. You may not look like it, but it is the spirit of Deborah. But first and foremost, you must be delivered first. God is not finished with her. I command that devil, go. There is no hiding in his presence. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hold my hands, my dear. In the name of Jesus, the Lord God whom I serve, I command the reign of witchcraft as I hold you right now. Over your sisters, over your life and over your family, I command them to be broken right now. I release upon you grace for restoration. In the name of Jesus. And I pray for you that grace of Deborah that causes women to rise with the strength of men. I release that grace upon you. I want you to go and tell your sisters the Lord brings a visitation to them. Even as he did to Hannah at Shiloh, the Lord comes for them with strange visitations. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Now all those under the anointing, I command the spirits. Any spirit that has been located by God must leave the victims. Therefore in the name of Jesus and at the count of three, you know my voice. I represent his majesty. At the count of three, you must let them go now and forever. One. Two, three, be gone. Go out of their lives, destinies, now and forever. Out of their lives, out of their destinies, I prophesy recovery. I prophesy recovery. I prophesy recovery. For when a thief is caught, he's made to pay back tenfold. I command recovery. In the name of Jesus. Let them go. There is no hiding. For his light shines upon you. 
in the name of Jesus Christ listen if there is any project you are involved in lift your hand any project business project building project please just lift your hands before I pray we pray the prayer that will release speed projects I'm standing and I'm seeing an angel of the Lord walking across this place and I'm standing here and he's saying I should stretch my hands here there is a visitation that is coming for the people here therefore I stretch my hands Lord your will be done I don't know those who you are bringing perfection to them right now in the name of Jesus I release that unction and that grace everyone within this vicinity let there be supernatural deliverances and supernatural miracles help them in the name of Jesus Christ in the mighty name of Jesus Christ in the mighty name of Jesus Christ now everyone is standing I want to pray for you please listen there is such a thing as advancement in a man's life it's not a doctrine it's an experience where a man can make progress spiritually financially business wise if you are in a position for a long time is a sign that something is wrong are we together it says ye have come past this mountain long enough then it tells you the formula the door is in the north it said turn northwards turn northwards you have come past this mountain long enough I want you to stand on the ground I see physical fire rising and sweeping consuming people's feet some of you as this is happening you will hear the sounds of physical chains literally physical chains this will happen I want us to shout the name of Jesus three times that's what the Holy Ghost is telling me I will lead you and you will shout it the third time the chains of delay and stagnation will will break open many of you physically physically you feel it happening Thank you, Jesus. Let the word of God come upon this prophecy. Are you ready now? Number one. Are you ready? Number two. Libra Katu Soto Barikata. Now I want you to get ready. That grace that came upon Elijah and caused him to run, overtaking the chariots of Ahaz speed and advancement is coming on people right now are you ready shout jesus receive it now receive it now let the earth deliver to your destiny the keys of advancement i command you to advance i command you to move forward i break limitations i break limitations I command advancement outside advancement the overflows advancement may that anointing hit you advancement 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 in the name of Jesus the son of the living God no power can stop you God is greater, our God is stronger, God you are higher than any other, Help me. our God is healer, awesome in power. Stretch your hands towards me. Don't lift it up. Stretch it towards me. There is, there is going to be an activation 
of strange gifts strange gifts strange gifts strange gifts the time for impartation will come but fire is living and it's coming upon people and the Lord said let them stretch their hands in the name of Jesus I stretch my hands back to you in the name of Jesus gifts 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 dormant gifts dormant gifts where is it I call it forth now dormant gifts dormant gifts you may not know it's there I'm not talking of the gifts of the spirit I'm talking of potentials gifts gifts I stir it up right now like a well I command it like the axe head I command it to float right now I command it to float right now gifts that will bring you honor gifts so toko toko to gifts hallelujah hallelujah gifts there is a lady i'm looking at you now in the realm of the spirit you are dressed in something that looks like orange like the house addressing from your head to who is that who is that come from this room jesus praise what's your name veronica from where i came from abuja you came from abuja as i stood here i was hearing your prayer and you were saying lord let this man of god locate me and the lord is saying i should tell you that two things now number one is captivity and reproach is being rolled away from your life that's the first thing that is happening to you captivity and reproach captivity and reproach inside inside the main auditorium from where people sit in front count nine lines nine rows one two three four five six seven eight nine the power of god is coming on somebody on that row right now inside inside it's a strange miracle coming for that person the ninth row supernatural manifestation of the power of god my sister what do you want the lord to do in your life uh -uh. you are just generalizing huh i'm looking at you and then i'm seeing your heart and i'm seeing should i say it do you believe you can are you married huh where's your husband did you come with him what do you want the lord to do for him see this man is your real prayer that's that's you want the lord to honor him and what what is he doing now i'm seeing him leaving that place oh, to another place that has been your desire go and tell him that a man of god has prophesied to him that he's going to leave that place supernaturally supernaturally and that he should stop wasting his time over the person he's calling all the time to help him that's not where his help will come from go and tell him that the lord said he can raise help anywhere in the name of jesus christ i pray amen and amen there is a lady here in this room in this um place i'm hearing grace please let's hurry up quickly so i can leave this place we have to pray for the sick i'm hearing grace grace who is that you are down at that side grace who is that wearing red grace that's okay grace your name is grace this is not this is is it my muna is it Maimuna or something? I'm hearing a name, Maimuna. 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 I wish we had time today, but we have to pray for the sick. I want us to leave this very fast because I'm going to counsel. Well, just leave her. I found a person, but, but you come. My dear, I want to pray. Who is this? No, 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 no. It's not just any grace. I'll pray for you. My dear, lift your hands. God wants to visit your family. There are four people here a very strange unction for revelation and teaching is coming upon you now no 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 four of you right now a strong power is hitting you right now just in this this place outside i don't know what it is about this place maybe the miracle services will start coming here now there is there's real faith in this place my dear i end it now i end it now in the name of jesus christ 
keep your hands on her stomach i end it now i command that reproach taken from your life in the name of jesus don't come out for social reasons but i'm seeing a lady here you have suffered a very terrible infection this is a, a woman issue a terrible infection this thing you have treated it and done everything you know to do but it has refused to go this is witchcraft it's not just a normal infection you have spent your money but right now the lord is saying i should prophesy to you that it comes to an end complete end right now in the name of jesus christ complete end i stretch my hands four people right now here in this row lord where are they one is a lady three are gentlemen step into that dimension that's right help them thank you jesus hold on there is a mother here god wants to wipe yes madam who is a gala here hold on you are a gala from where from where Oppo. where is that is there a place like that in the gala land huh in kogi state so that you don't come and tell us lies if, if you are not from there just wait there is your turn to come from lift your hands i'm seeing an attack on your life and your family and the lord is too free madam where is your child did you come with your child There's no time to waste, please. I'll just pray for you so that we can go. In the name of witchcraft, now. In on you right now. Jesus Christ. In the name Jesus Christ. Lift your hand. Say after me, in the name of Jesus. Say it, in the name of Jesus. The anointing of the Holy Spirit is bringing into my life strange testimonies lift your voice and begin to pray lift your voice those outside are you praying lift your voice and begin to pray kai one of the things listen hold on i'm seeing now i want you to believe it i just looked up and i started hearing the cry of i see babies just fill the room listen carefully I just lifted i wanted to move and i just lifted my eyes and the lord told me that one of the major miracles he's doing tonight is giving people children if you are standing in for barrenness whether you are in any overflow please come in i want to minister to you by myself barrenness only barrenness please husband and wife if you are standing for barrenness except you are standing in for someone if you are standing alone you must be married praise god if you are standing alone you must be married in the name of jesus may that grace come upon you by the power of the holy spirit please stand you can go you can go pastor alpha now we are going to pray and while they are doing that let's buy time ushers move around all the overflows make sure you collect the request of everybody i notice overflow three there are few people attending to them there so let's have people you see why we need more ushers and we need more people say after me father, father. everyone shout it father, father. We, receive we receive your visitation in the name of jesus we receive miracles signs and wonders now please accept they ask you you don't have to tell them what is wrong don't worry the hand of god is here to bless you in the name of jesus christ father we give you all the praise those online i want you to connect by faith and trust the power of god to touch you we have very few minutes to do this and in the name of jesus will be done no matter what the issue is as we touch you start checking yourself you can register your testimony we'll take it on friday whether you are standing in for someone don't worry the power of god is there to touch you in the name of jesus father we give you all the praise do you know why I came here? Because I saw that this woman, your issue is not just healing. Hold on. I saw the, her holding pictures and a passport. And then I'm looking at it. 
and I saw a plane. Is it something like you were staying outside the country? Is that true? Yes, sir. Because I'm seeing a woman, a plane, bringing you. Is that true? Uh -uh. And the Lord is opening my eyes. I'm seeing another vision. I'm seeing a quarrel between you and a man, like your husband. And that man drove you. Yes, sir. He drove? Yes, sir. From where? From abroad. Where is abroad? Qatar. From where? Where is he? This is you? Ah. Oh my God. This is a baby. Look at me. Why did he drive you away? You see why prophecy is powerful. Look at this woman. Come, madam. I looked at these things and the Lord told me that this woman needs help. I know I'm taking time, but let's attend. Madam, don't cry. It's okay. Where were you before? No other man. We are together in our blood. We are together. Are, were you married? Yes, sir. You are from where? Benway State, sir. You are from Benway? Yes, sir. You see, I told you what God was saying about Benway. You, you married him and went abroad? Yes, sir. Then what happened? He said that you come back. My paper is having issue. Not knowing that he went and married secretly from my community. <laughs> So he married another woman. Yeah, from my same community, sir. He's staying abroad with her. Yes, sir. He drove you away with the baby. Yes, sir. No, he drove me when the pregnancy was one week. Did he know you were pregnant? No, sir. Immediately I took it. He now see, said I should come see, back. Man, listen. This this is what we, we keep saying again and again. Please listen to me. Now I don't mean no disrespect but you see why ladies will tell you people to marry people who are born again not just people who have money huh? don't let anybody just come and show you one shoe one bag and just carry you around like that it must be godly look at what this man did for this woman one week and left her with this innocent child so where are you staying now i'm staying out in abuja so my it's sister. from abuja you came yes sir what do you want God to do for you? I want God to bring him back for me, sir. He married another woman. Yes, sir. She knew you were his wife. Yes, And she knew. still came and married. Yes, my dad is also here, sir. Where's your dad? Daddy, please come, sir. Oh, he cannot walk. After my marriage, I now send stroke to him, sir. He's from, okay, Benway too. Yes, sir. Why am I seeing light leaving you to this man? Come. What's your relationship with her? He's my stepbrother. I'm a first, uh, I mean, stepbrother, the firstborn of the family. You are the firstborn? Yes, sir. From where? From a Benin state. You are suffering. Hi. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. Nothing is working your life. Yes, sir. At all. You need the hand of God. Look at your father. Look at this man. Look at this dear man. You see this this brothers and sisters believe it or not is what witchcraft looks like are you seeing this whether you are in Qatar or wherever if that spirit is not destroyed this is what it will do because I stood and I looked at her and I saw a plane carrying a woman but she didn't look if you see this woman does she look like somebody who has gone abroad I'm not insulting you you can see that this woman was not even treated well. Suffered with the man. Now we went abroad and sent her back. When this baby now, if we decide to carry this baby and take care of this baby, when this baby becomes responsible, the man will now call the court and come and say he wants his child back. Then they will now accuse men of God and accuse everybody and say everybody is stupid. You are using the baby to make to get power. You see why sometimes we avoid these things it's not because we cannot help people honestly it's because sometimes the media right now are experts at stigmatizing men of god you do anything to try to help this baby now you'll be in trouble are we together help me you're the god of us one he stood up your power Stand up. Stand up. 
the Lord is opening my eyes the same spirit that made that man drive you is making him fight with this woman now they are not even no 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 I'm not seeing peace huh? I'm not seeing peace I'm seeing a situation where this man is coming and checking the woman's phone and then I'm seeing another man's text and the man is giving her a dirty slap slap on her face Bible said what God has joined what's his name Simon in the name of Jesus Christ by the power that created the heavens and the earth I call you back to your wife in the name of Jesus may you encounter a man of God and an anointing that will save you and deliver you there and I declare in the name of Jesus this baby will not be a bastard baby I speak to you every foundational thing programmed in your spirit as a baby we cancel it right now madam look at me I decree and declare the favor that was on Esther that made Hadassah look at her once and had to call her to be his queen may that favor come upon you listen don't go to any native doctor you hear me because I'm seeing one mama coming to you in Abuja and she's telling you that there's somebody she told you is a man of God is a native doctor don't go anywhere huh? and number two anybody that says you should bring one naira what did I say one naira for prayer just thank him and walk away if, if this poor woman you still collect money from her for prayer then you must be a very wicked person isn't it in the name of Jesus he will return with testimony my brother come are you working what do you want God to do in your life um, I'm a pastor so when I I mean God called me into ministry so in the field the back to the I mean the came so tough the the attack and the uh, foundation it became so strong so I took up I, I couldn't stay but up, up to now God is still calling me back to where I serve him I've been serving him to where, where were you serving in Kogi State no you need mentorship you need covering you need impartation you don't just get up like that and go into ministry God saved you they would have killed you like a chicken there are rules to this thing eh? it's not just because you touch somebody and he fell down you get up and go to Kogi State do you know what pursued you back eh? is the mercy of God it's not witchcraft they would you would have died like a chicken please listen I'm not scaring you but there are systems don't get up out of zeal and just say I am anointed be careful as powerless as Satan is is your understanding that this depowers him if you don't have that understanding you can be anointed and your life will be destroyed praise the Lord my brother hold my hands I'm not just seeing you doing ministry truly you need help eh? you need help after service come and see this man pastor Alpha eh? after service come and see him he will talk with you and guide you and train you and help you in the name of Jesus Christ a time of prophecy and activations some of you are here because you desire higher levels of unction in your ministries your lives your businesses the prophetic word of God is very powerful when there is grace back in it because it does not only reveal it creates are we together in the next about two or three minutes I want your heart to genuinely and desperately be open be open in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ I'm seeing a grace walking in this gentleman you are the first I know you are doing protocol work but you are the first to receive this grace I see a grace of two of you supernatural grace of the Holy Ghost taking you to a new dimension in the spirit hallelujah Benga come grace for another dimension of fire lift your hands grace fresh fire fresh dimension 
fresh fire, fresh dimension, fresh fire, fresh dimension. You speak and there is power of performance, power of performance, power of performance, power of performance. No word will be empty. You speak and there is grace and the power of performance. Hallelujah. Someone come and hold. Victor, come. Come and hold them. Somebody. Grace. Supernatural influence. And wisdom. And victory. In a strange dimension. A dimension you have never seen in your life. In the name of Jesus. Supernatural grace. I open up that level. Grace. In the name of Jesus Christ. 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 Where shall they? We're rounding up. They are doing their. Please, someone hold her. I don't want. Hold the child. These people will have just a minute or two. Hold her. Make sure that. Ladies, you come and hold her. Father, in the name of Jesus, the Lord is quickening the power of sight, the grace to see, grace to see, the grace to see. Make sure you are holding her well. The grace to see. In the name of Jesus. Penny, you are taking back fresh fire, fresh fire, in the name of Jesus Christ fresh fire i'm not it's not like i'm just speaking people this is this is just by the spirit come the lord is bringing glory on you fresh fire is upon your hands in the name of jesus christ listen is it hold on we're out of time but pastor house on the rock come you have been desiring something for a long time. Come. God is giving it to you in this season. In the name of Jesus. May that fire. May that grace. Take a drink of that wine. In the name of Jesus. Fresh unction. Fresh unction. Capacity. Open up your capacity in the spirit. In the name of Jesus Christ. There's a heavy spirit on that small girl. In the name of Jesus Christ. Place it on her. Just place it on her. Leave, leave it there. In the name of Jesus. Judgment upon that devil. Foul spirit. Hallelujah. We're out of time, but I want you to receive. Let me start with the men of God. You are in ministry here. It's time to take something heavy and something genuine. Let me pray. Jamfa, come. Ejimi, come. I'm seeing a, a new, a truly new grace and a new wine. New grace. And a new one is supernatural dimension. Dimension. This grace will speak in unbelievable ways. Lord, bring him into that experience. In the name of Jesus. Truly bring him into that experience. I open up. I open up. I open up. Closed fountains. I open up now. Closed fountains. I open up now. Fire. Fresh grace for influence. Influence, influence, business influence, new grace, new dimensions of wealth, influence, commanding miracles, strange miracles. Collect that child from hope. Collect that child from hope. In the name of Jesus, fresh fire hope. I activate that dimension. Fresh fire. In the name of Jesus, God is giving you eyes that see strange dreams revealing direction for people's lives in the name of jesus where's aaron aaron 
Where is Aaron? In the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord says I should tell you. Seasons of reward are before you. Seasons of great and strange reward. Father let it be. By the power of your spirit. By the power of your spirit. Lift your hands. In the name of Jesus Christ. God, something is coming strong. Go. for new levels in ministry at the count of three if you are here in ministry there is a call of God upon your life one, two that fire comes now take that fire now take that fire a new level of ministry a new level of power a new level of grace never to be buried never to be buried never to be buried Never to be buried. Where is Yerima, head of department media? Please come quickly. Quickly, I'm praying. Where is he? Oh, that's him there. In the name of Jesus, the Lord says he's bringing you honor, untold honor, untold honor by the Spirit of the living God. Untold honor, untold honor, untold honor. Now I decree and declare. Jordan, where's Jordan? Jordan bookstore. I hear restoration. Where are you? Restoration fire. That restoration fire. In the name of Jesus. Everything the canker worm, the palmer worm has stolen. Restoration. In the name of Jesus. Now I pray for you. By the power of the Holy Ghost. The Spirit of God comes upon you. And you begin to run like Elijah. I prophesy speed. Receive it now. Receive it now. Speed, speed, speed. Speed. By the unction of the spirit. Speed. By the unction of the spirit. Speed. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Every helper of your destiny that is supposed to show up and partner with you and endorse you to the next level in the name of Jesus I stretch my hands and I place an unction on your life receive of their ministry now receive of their ministry now receive of their ministry now where's Pastor Alpha's wife? just hold her there is heavy so in the name of Jesus the Lord is saying have I not said I will bring you favor it will manifest God is bringing favor after you give birth to your child pastor your family will step into a strange level of favor it will be at the commencement of this boy's birth or this child the moment the child is born in the name of Jesus Christ there will be strange miracles by the anointing of the Holy Spirit I pray for you the kind of glory and honor you have never seen upon your life I declare receive it now receive it right now all your tithes your giving God has released the blessings but something has hijacked it in the realm of the spirit Jabakatos Kebranda Lates Kaprete Kapariatos I command the release of your harvest. I command the release of your harvest. I command the release of your harvest. Whatever was not working in your life before you came here, I decree by the Spirit of the Living God, go back to it and watch it work in a way that will shock you. Whoever opens his mouth, to mock your God goes down immediately I say it again whoever opens his mouth to mock your God goes down immediately anyone here been eyed by the spirit of death to make sure that the earth kills you to make sure that you die or any bad news from your family I cancel it right now in the name of Jesus Christ 
as you step into the month of May by the power that is in the name of Jesus I declare in one month alone in one month he said have you ever had this that a city is born in one day he said but as soon as Zion travails she shall put forth a son I declare in one month this month of May a dimension of the ministry of the Holy Spirit to bring you strange results receive it in the name of Jesus receive it in the name of Jesus I pray for your family members in the name that is above all names if they have never testified from January till now I command testimonies from next month I pray for those who are students you wrote your exams you cannot rest you are afraid whatever went wrong I change it now whatever went wrong I change it now I don't care what went wrong I change it now anyone here trusting God for a job by May miracle service as surely as the God of heaven lives may God shake the heavens and the earth and give you your job and you are here you are walking and they've refused to promote you whoever sits on your promotion gets out of his office in the name of Jesus Christ any human being on this earth who has fraternized with the elements of the supernatural to limit your life I pray now I command all the elements of the supernatural to fight them the same way the stars fought for Deborah I command the earth to fight them I command their success to fight them anyone who has trivialized your grace and neglected what you represent to make sure that doors don't open for you I decree and declare in their presence the Lord will lift you any prayer life here that has died because of carelessness carnality whatever it is sin that has been responsible for destroying your prayer life your passion you were on fire for God but there's laziness carelessness lukewarmness in the name of Jesus like the hair of Samson I command a sevenfold restoration for you now prayer fire in the name of Jesus Christ whatever has destroyed your world life no passion you carry your Bible you don't even know what to study you make up your mind that you will study there is a grace that helps men I pray in the name of Jesus may that enabling grace come upon your life now may that enabling grace come upon your life now the final prayer I want to pray for you listen there is a name that God is called the lifter of men hear me don't let any man lie to you that he can lift you on his own a man can receive nothing except it is given to him do you know lifting is a sign that God is with you yes read your Bible lifting to leave your current position to another is not a sign of pigmanism it truly is a sign that God is with you read your Bible there is nobody that God was with who he did not lift God who can pick a man from a donkey many of us it's not like you are doing bad but where you are you have been there for a long time everybody is rising and they come and see you spiritually financially please don't let anybody indoctrinate you that lifting is not of god if you are not lifted you will be frustrated at a point because the only way to bless others is as you are rising therefore i speak to your life the god who has gloriously lifted this ministry the God who by his spirit has helped us given us a voice connected us to over 44 nations of the earth 
supernaturally by his spirit i pray in the name of jesus wherever on the surface of the earth your lifting is tied to i decree and declare maraka dos calibre getelator mare dos copre teke labariatata be lifted now in the name of jesus be lifted now in the name of jesus i speak to your business whatever you do be lifted now in the name of jesus i speak to your ministry be lifted now in the name of jesus they are taken for a prey and none say it restore i say restore i prophesy restore in the name of jesus wave your hands and give jesus all the praise believe you have been blessed by this message. For additional information, you can visit us on Facebook on www.facebook.com slash Koinonia Eternity Network International or follow us on Twitter www.twitter.com slash Koinonia underscore ENI. You can also download our messages on www.forshared.com Trinity Network International, duplicating the coolness of God's life on earth.
Thank you for watching our entire video today. If you feel you can bless someone, please join us and spread the gospel by sharing this video on your social media.